Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mariah and today I thought I'd show you a couple of things that came in the mail over the week from Amazon. Um, it is dark and gloomy here in Texas. I'm in Austin and it's been raining today. So the lighting's not all that great. I do apologize. Um, so let's do this this one first, the big one. It's in a big mailing envelope. Um, I'm going to try to use my new handy dandy scary blade. Wait, okay. Hope everybody's doing well. This is my second video for today. Ooh, this cuts like butter. It cuts good. Okay. All right, so um, I hopefully there's a couple of things um, going on in December. Um, I might be included in one of them, and I'm super excited. I did order my first Treasure Art Studio Christmas canvas for that. However, I'm not sure if it's going to arrive in time. So as a backup, I went on Amazon and got my first Timmy Arts. So this is it. I don't want to cut the canvas. Okay. So this is going to be my first Timmy Arts. Uh, this canvas um, was 7.73 after taxes. Um, right off the bat, I can see that it's it does have a fabric. Surprise! Okay. All right. So it looks like poured glue, right? That's just a dirt spot. That's okay. Looks like poured glue. I'm going to roll it back on itself because I think it's, oh, I'm not sure, but we'll find out. I don't know what happens if you roll something that's not poured glue, but it's got the clear cover, so I'm assuming that's probably a bad thing to do. All right, so let's check it out. So, first thing I'm noticing are the symbols are very clear. They look good. The canvas, like I said, is a cloth on the back. Kind of like um, what Crafty Bleeds was. It says Timmy Arts Diamond Painting at the top. It does have the scalloped edges. And there is some shimmer and shine in their canvas. As well uh, as on the drill field. Very sticky. So, so far, I like it. Alright, so we got the color chart right here. There is 26 colors. The symbols look very clear. Um, I don't think they come with ABs. I think maybe I could be wrong, but maybe it's just most companies don't have them yet. I'm not sure. You also have the key up here on the upper left. At the bottom, it does say the model number. The name of this canvas is Squirrel Snowman, and it's a 35 by 40 centimeter. I should have brought my tape measure. I did not. Sorry, guys. Um, just tells you the instructions on, you know, tips on what not to do with your canvas. And then it's got the website down here. So again, I just wanted something 
I, I don't want a huge when it comes to the holiday canvases I'm not gonna get a large one because I'm not gonna spend money on something that I'm not gonna frame and hang or gift to somebody and I know that I, I'm not gonna put up a holiday they're pretty don't get me wrong they're pretty but I know myself so I'm not gonna waste the money on huge ones but this is definitely something that that I can do just for the holiday and he's cute, right? What do you think? I believe it's around. I haven't even opened the drills yet. I noticed it doesn't come. I didn't get any. Let me check in the bag. Okay. There's no uh, inventory sheet or anything that I could see. But it's just basically you got the snowman. It looks like a red cardinal up at the top. The little squirrel is wearing a Christmas hat now. It does look a little pixelated, but this is for fun. And this is for Christmas, and I think it's a perfect size. I'm not mad at it. It was under $8, and I'm actually not disappointed in the canvas. There, It is a little dirty right here, but that's okay. It's the back. Um... Let's look at the drills. Well, first, it does come with a tool kit. Looks like you get one square pink wax, one green boat, one blue pin with a single placer, and probably about five baggies. That's the tool kit. And this is the drill. And it's X0088, so let's just check that real quick. Should match the canvas. There it is. Right here. X0088. So we've got a matching set. That's good. Oh, I see an AB in there, guys. Okay. Uh, how do I get in this thing? Okay, bear with me. Okay, right off the bat, we do have a little pink AB. It looks like um, this is just numbered. Uh, right here you can see the 127 I have really bad eyes so I might not read all these numbers on these drills guys but I'll show you the colors for sure um, let's see. when I go to kit this up I'll probably put it like in a I'll just do something I don't know if I'm doing, I'm currently doing my first, oops, sorry, I bumped you. I'm currently doing my first one out of bags. I'm not sure how I'm liking that yet. But this is a pale pink AB. Not bad. All right, let's see. All right, so these numbers I can read better. We've got 704, which is like a green. Looks like there's a bubble drill right there. See how the bottom caves in. Again, guys, this is like less than $8, so I'm not expecting like premium <laughs> drills or anything. 700 green 699 darker green I'm noticing that these drills um, the numbers are way easier to read than what's on the AB oh we got a 666 six, six. love red 597 Four ninety eight, 
which is like a maroon. And we got a little piece of debris up there. That's okay. 434 433 322 Ooh, just a little bag. Uh, three tenths. That's our first chain. Let me move this off to the side. Okay. Second one, we got 200, which is white. A, B again, orange this time, 131. So it's got two A, Bs, guys, so far for under $8. That's going to be fun. Oh, wait, wait. We have another. Here's A, B number three. She's a green, 134. Look at all that sparkle. So we have pink, orange, and green. But wait, there is a fourth. <laughs> we got a fourth, guys. 136. This one's a blue. This one's really pretty. It's like a royal blue or purple. So four ABs, four, for a kit that was under $8, not bad. And this is 3830. The last strip here. We got 3811, it's like a mint. 3778. 3777 3771 I could see the static up in these see I'm moving there's gonna be static in these I've never had an issue with static drills before but let's see that's all right uh, 338 I'm sorry 938 the brown. Eight ninety. It's like a forest green. Eight twenty three. Eight fourteen. It's like a wine color. Matches my nails. 783 and then the last color is 740 so I'm excited that there's four ABs for this little painting guys let's flip it back over so if I could try to figure out like how am I gonna figure it out Let me see. This one is one two seven. Oh wait, it might be these symbols down here. One two seven. One thirty six. One thirty four. One thirty one. Okay. Let's do this right there. All right, so it's it's gonna be. These last four right here. So 136, 127, 134, and 131. So let's look for 136 first. So 136 is going to be the blue. So we're going to have it up, up here in his hat. Up here, right there. Some right here in this area. We get a little bit over here behind the squirrel. 
I already said there. Okay, second symbol we're looking for. Somebody one time, this symbol right here. I've seen in one of the Facebook groups one time. Someone said that that reminded her of a butt. <laughs> to me, it looks like an eyeball or something. But now every time I, I have to do that symbol, I remind it reminds me of the lady saying it's like a butt. You know, like the side profile. Anyways, moving on. 127. So it's going to be a cream. Right? Okay. He's up in the squirrel. So we got it right here on the squirrel's face. All up in the squirrel's tail. Right here right here so basically on the squirrel all right so that one's going to be for the squirrel it looks like the next one is 134 which is a green all right and it's an the l so we've got it right here up here in the holly leaf up here, up in the tree over here. Basically anywhere you see green, right here, right here, right here. Nothing there, right here. Right there, I already said that. All right, and then the last one is 131, which was, that's this pink. So it's going to be right here, all right here in the scarf, up in the hat, on his mittens, on both mittens. So mittens and scarf and the hat is where you're going to see that pink. Okay, not bad guys. I'm not going to lie, this is totally worth the buy. I know I can tell already I'm going to have issues with static e drills, but that's okay. The canvas looks good. Um, there's like no rivers or anything. The, the spacing looks nice. There is training circles. There are training circles, but that's okay. Like I said, this is just a, a holiday project for me to do. Okay. Let's put this off to the side. Um, the next thing. On my Amazon buy. I gotta be careful with this box cutter. I hurt myself. Open it. Okay. Why? What is happening? Okay, so you guys already know I'm a glue dot user, micro glue, glue dots, that is. And um, I can't find them in the craft stores. I can only get them uh, on Amazon. So the other day I went to get another package and I think it was like five or six dollars before and the price goes up and down. You guys, they're trying to charge me $12. I don't think so. So then I went to the glue dots on Amazon themselves, the manufacturer. What is all this? And I got three boxes of the micro glue dots. See, it says micro. And they've got a roll of 325 dots right here. 
this is the one you want to look for it's got the purse um, I know they have other ones but this is what I like to use either way three pack for $15 so I, did I need three right now no but I'm not gonna spend some crazy amount later okay so oops that was my address all big Okay, so this is the receipt and then I don't know what this stuff is what is all this I don't know they gave me these things I have no no idea oh wait oh you know what okay I figured it out oh uh, okay these are different samples of different size glue this is high tack and then on the back underneath here so you can see that little the, sh the shadow let me sh pull it back look see there's a glue dot so they gave me a big sample looks like one two three four five five or six of the high tack low Oh wait. Okay, they all say I don't know. I'm confusing myself. Low profile one half inch high tack. Uh, low profile one half inch super high tack. Medium profile half inch super high tack. High profile. God, oh, good lord. Look at them things. <laughs> it's like almost the size of a penny and they're super duper thick look at that that's crazy I appreciate the samples though and then cartoon releasing I have no idea what half of these ones are but it's nice of them to throw samples in because then you could test it out before you purchase and then just a pamphlet I guess on how to use glue dots probably talks about the business Oh, shoot. Here comes Gypsy. Gypsy girl. Okay. I only have two more, guys, and I'm almost done. Sorry. Sticking to the theme of Christmas. And I'm not... Sh Oops. I don't know if I should use this. You guys, I have a feeling I'm going to hurt myself with this thing one day. Sticking to the theme of Christmas. Um, I was on the hunt for a drill pin. Now, I really want like a red glitter just red glitter I can't find any so I did find this one though well let's see okay this is the green one this one's also all of these are from Amazon today guys this was Nine forty-three. So it's green. And okay, so it comes with a single placer. Looks like a two or a three tip right here. Maybe a five. And then whatever that one is. I'm still learning. Let me see if I can I right, open this. There we go. So this pin shape is like a pear. And I've never had this kind of shape before. So I'm curious. See how it feels. Ooh. Oh, ooh. Okay, I don't know if y'all can see. Sorry. That over there is Gypsy. She decided to be in the video today. Let me bring the light. You guys, this is... The light's not going to do it, but... It's got like that pearlidescent, like right here. Um, on camera, it doesn't do that, but all of this lighter color, it's like really pr like a pearl. This is cute. I'm happy with it. And again, this one was less than $10. Feels good. Actually, the more I'm looking at it, it's not so pear, right? Well, 
I guess this part is longer and skinny. Then you got your fat middle and a short chubby end. Is that a pear? Maybe if it was. But look at the colors, guys. She's pretty. Not mad at it. Not mad at it. Okay. And then one last one. So that will be one of my Christmas pins. And I have this one. Gypsy's making herself a little cozy spot in my other box. She's tiny. She's my tiny cat. I got a big fat cat and a tiny midget cat. She's pro I think we weighed her and she's like right under six pounds. She's supposed to get fixed on Monday, and I hope she she's at the weight limit. She's almost three. Okay, my last one of the day. Um, like I said, I was on the hunt for a red glitter, or even a red good one, and this is what I found. This one was eleven ninety nine. Um, oh, it's not even red. Ah, oh, disappointed. <laughs> It's not red. It's like, it's like a coral, coral and clear. I mean, it's still cool. It's um, like the medium size or not medium. It's a thin pin, lightweight. It's still pretty. It's just not red. I was hoping for red, red. This is more like, like this is red. And you can see like red. Okay, maybe this doesn't help, but it's not red take my word for it it's more like a orangey peach coral color in clear um, and then it also comes with three multi placers down here same size as the other these are two different brands um, and the names have like initials and stuff in them so I'll put the links down in my video description if you guys are interested so anyways um that concludes today's video guys uh might do i don't know if i'm gonna do another one today um but there will be one coming soon and my giveaway winner i'm gonna have to figure out how to use that um Sorry guys, I'm trying to not cut myself and put this, I'm not even going to mess with it. I was trying to put the tip on this. Um, I'll be doing the video soon, you guys, for the giveaway. So one last chance, guys, if you haven't already, go watch that video and enter to win. Um, I appreciate all of you guys. Hope everybody has a great weekend and I guess I'll see you next time. Bye.